Season one. You'll be thrilled. I haven't been thrilled since 1865. I live with my sister, Ada. It wasn't my idea to bring our niece into the home. And who is to support her? Exactly, me. The season is about assimilating Marion into our traditional life. You belong to old New York, my dear. Don't let anyone tell you different. I give Marion a hard time. We're not being fair, Aunt Agnes. But I feel that Agnes has her best interests in mind. I'm very concerned about Marion's relationship to Mr. Rakes. What's wrong with him? He is an adventurer, and I am never wrong. I feel that he's an opportunist. Isn't it just possible you may have misjudged him? It is just possible an earthquake may destroy New York, but it's not likely. And then the arrival of our neighbors, the Russell family. They are new money, and Agnes is appalled at how they're trying to elbow their way into society. Why don't we just go outside and roll in the gutter? It will save time. I love Agnes with her crustiness. She's got that sense of, we were here first. New York is a collection of villages. We know the people who live in our own village. Agnes is going to just be Agnes. The Russells live in your village, Mama. You're stating facts. I'm not concerned with facts. Not if they interfere with my beliefs. At the end of the season, Mrs. Astor asked Agnes, unthinkable, if you consider yourselves to be my friends, you will attend Mrs. Russell's ball this evening. Really? Just because she attended this ball does not mean she changes her opinion about Bertha or the world in which is rapidly changing around her. If necessary, we can quarrel with her later. 